Hi everyone and welcome back to another aviation news video from Aviation Cult. I am back from a little break from YouTube at Aviation Cult but anyways I'm back and let's get straight into today's news. Today's news comes from Abu Dhabi based carrier Etihad Airways. So Etihad Airways unveiled on April the 30th a special livery on one of the carrier's Airbus A380 aircraft to celebrate the year of Zaid after its ruler in Abu Dhabi. It was inspected by Zaid Al Nayan in one of the carrier's engineering facilities in Abu Dhabi International Airport and was formally accepted to fly. The special livery is just one element of Etihad's initiatives which will work alongside with Zaid to produce the year of Zaid's themes consisting of wisdom, respect, sustainability and human development which is something that the country aims to implement on a more potential level going away from the aviation side. Customers will get the chance to fly on this aircraft we will be offered a host of content and service that has been inspired by the Sheik, offering a new USP to the airline and potentially enticing customers to watch out for this specific airframe. Such themed offers will feature in-flight entertainment handpicked by the Sheik, kids pack and a photo gallery of the leader's life. A7-8PH will be the new highlight that everyone will be looking to fly on if they are heading towards Abu Dhabi. A7-8PH is one of the younger A380s in the fleet, showing an age of just 1.4 years, having been delivered in May 2017. The aircraft is configured with 8 first class seats, 48 business class seats and 461 economy seats, over offering over 500 passengers every flight with this new thing reflecting on the success of Zaid. This aircraft will provide the humanitarian aid initially starting from May as the year of the humanitarian freighter before eventually flying its commercial service as normal thereafter. It will be interesting to see whether it will just be one of the aircraft that will be painted in this livery or whether the initiative placed by the carrier and Zaid will continue onwards to different aircrafts across its fleet. So what do you think of this livery? Do you like this one or do you prefer the Emirates version of the Year of Zaid livery on their A380. Leave your thoughts down below and I'll try to reply to as many of you as possible. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video from Aviation Cult. If you liked it, make sure to leave a like. And if you like what you see, make sure to subscribe. Anyways, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time in another video. See ya! Oh.